Welcome to Nox A Carnival Volume 6 Festival in uh, SJC Drugstore, Berlin, where I have Hit by Pitch with me. Guys, first things first, uh, what can you tell me about your band? Yeah, what can we tell you about the band? Uh, we've been together for about, I think it's like in this formation, like two years more or less. Yes. And uh, being a band located in Berlin, we kind of it always feels like we had 150 different band members at the moment because there were uh, there's huge fluctuation of people into the city and out of the city. And now I think we have found a final formation finally for the last couple of months. Uh, there are some kind of interesting stories about their last guitar player being abducted to Nepal by his mother, having his uh, passport taken away and <laughs> not being able to return. Well, he left his he left his amp here, and now we have a new one um, for a <laughs> guitar amp, player. Yeah. <laughs> That's, so we got that going for us. Um, yeah, and. Uh, I don't know, what can you tell us about it? Well, I guess we, we have a, we're just a fun band, you know, because uh, we, we just love to, to play the music in the, in the style we do. And um, yeah, I guess it's a unique style. Um, I never heard music like this before, so it's a... <laughs> I think you wrote a concise definition on that on our marketing guy here. Uh, since he said it's somewhere between art and fart. Yes, that's... Uh, okay, so how would you describe your sound like? Uh, how can you, like... Is, the, the weird thing is we um, have a new drummer for a couple of months now and he's kind of, he, he is in a jazz band as well and he's playing playing kind of jazzy drums there and so we have this kind of, I don't know, 90s anthrax slayer vocals combined with uh, some jazzy, groovy, um, groovy tunes on the drums there um, and I don't, I think it's hard to describe what we actually sound like. You can, you can check us out on Spotify maybe and then have a, have a listen for yourself and Write your own description. Uh, yeah, well, you know, every metal band has their own category, right? So yeah, what's your category? What's your category? I don't know. It's, it's somewhere between trash and groove, I guess. Yeah. Okay, and you already said the words fun and fart. So <laughs> how big, you know, uh, place humor has in your music? Um, I think it's, it's actually more behind the scenes. You know, we, we, uh, I don't think we really take ourselves or the genre that series. We don't. We don't go out with with corpse paint and, and scream Satan Satan. Uh, we actually when we, last time we went to Cologne for a gig, for example, we were listening to Roxette all the time, and <laughs> I think that's uh, kind of going on behind the scenes. There, I don't know if we are on stage. If if people see that, you actually. you are kind of funny yeah, on stage. I, I, I don't want to be. It's just uh, <laughs> yes. Okay, let's go to lives. Uh, how would you describe uh, hit by pitch gig? The live gigs. Yeah. You want to have a go? <laughs> well, live gigs are loud, ecstatic. Tim, uh, our front man, he's ecstatic too. He's like crawling on the on the stage, on the floor and laughing his ass off. And yeah, it's like, it's uh, I, I, it's a good energy, I think. Yeah, that's what I love about the music. It's kind of, it's, I mean, what's hit by pitch is about. It's kind of a, of a play on words. Hit by pitch is, is a baseball term when you get hit by a baseball. And we kind of use this to you, you get hit by pitch. You get you get your fist in your uh, in your face from from the pitch, the, uh, the sound of our of our band. Okay, and we are here tonight, uh, as said, in drugstore, <coughs> Berlin. Uh, what are your thoughts on this kind of uh, do-it-yourself festival? Um. <laughs> well, well, it's it's a good thing because uh, there's a huge problem, a musical problem in Berlin. Like yeah, it's called techno. It's called techno at first, and the second one is uh, pay to play. So you have to pay oh, yeah. uh, to play on uh, live, and I guess that's a good thing for for all the bands. Uh, they are just playing for free and have fun together, and it's it's a cool uh, cool atmosphere. I guess it's also a lot of gigs we played. We did have, we didn't have this metal setting, so we're playing together with I don't know some some funk band or some some uh, some pop or rap band. It's kind of it can be kind of cool, but you really sometimes you don't have the audience. So you, you get on stage and you, you, you just scream and you go insane on stage, and people are like oh, what the fuck's that? And that sometimes happens. And I think here we have a, we kind of have our audience, which is which is cool. Okay, and from there we can go to the you know important question: uh, How do you see the metal scene here in Berlin? The metal scene here in Berlin. Well, um, it's kind of strange. I'm, I'm from from the west of Germany, from Cologne originally, and there the metal scene is a bit it's a bit bigger. It's it's kind of this old, uh, uh, it's this, this worker city, and <coughs> the metal is a bit more ingrained in there. But for some reason, we don't have a, have a metal radio station there. Here in Berlin, we do have a radio station that's that's playing metal, but we don't really have. We have some clubs, and there's a bit of a metal scene, but there's this huge techno scene going on, which is kind of like this. Germans love this factory kind of sound music, uh, and uh, I'm I'm kind of missing um, the metal scene in Cologne, which I think it's a bit it's a bit cooler. 
But um, what is here is pretty cool. So it's, it's not that that big of a scene, but it's um, it's very it's very true in a way. Okay, and uh, as you said, you know sometimes maybe the humor stays behind there, and um, you love the scene. But uh, what does metal music mean to you? So why is it metal and not the minimalistic techno? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's it's more like I guess we we all grew up with with rock or heavy music. And it's it's the thing we, we like to do, and it's, uh, it's, it's, it's the energy. It's, yeah, it's, it's about it's raising it. a middle finger and saying, yeah. hey, "Screw it!" It's about rock and roll. Basically, I mean, metal is kind of rock and roll, what it, what it boils down to. And this is the energy, the the, the attitude, basically, the attitude, the the whole thing. So it's a lifestyle. It's not just the music for me. Okay, uh, do you have some influences from uh, older bands? Like, who do you look up rock, to? Rock, rock, fucking sets. Rock, rock sets, yes. Or, it's the biggest influence, <laughs> probably. Um, and if for me, um, as a singer, it's probably John Bush from from Anthrax <coughs> in, the, in the 90s. Um, yeah, I don't know what you... Yeah, I'm, I'm just playing, so... <laughs> <laughs> He's just a nice player. I'm, I'm just the best player, so... Ah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I think, yeah, I mean, maybe if you... Well, I, I love I love older metal, like Iron Maiden and, and, and Judas Priest. Um, and then I love... Um, and I don't really like this all the, all this doom and, and, and this stuff so much. But I think we also have some influences of that as well in our music. Um, and yeah, I mean, yeah, and I mean, for me, so, so Pantera, Anthrax in the 90s, Slayer, this is for me, it's as hard as it gets before, it's, um, before it stops being cool. That's, that's my, my attitude. And I'm not speaking for the band at the moment, it's just my personal attitude. Okay, and uh, how do you see the future of the band? Like, <laughs> uh, how easy, for example, it is to, you know, uh, some to bigger, bigger circles from Berlin? Ooh, it's it's uh, very difficult. It's um, pretty hard. The, the things I said with pay to play, it's it's hard to find um, gigs uh, to find an audience at first. So um, we we hope we're gonna get the crowd together uh, and yes, gonna expand a little. But I I don't know how how far it takes us. I mean, we are on Spotify at the moment. <laughs> we will go to to the studio in, um, uh, in the beginning of next year. We have a couple of new songs out, um, and I think. For what we want it to be, it's pretty good. I mean, we're not going to be on stage and be like, I don't know, ACDC and then fill stadium, fill the whole stadium. But uh, it's fun to go on stage. It's fun to to kick ass with the music, and this is all we want from it, I think. Okay, thank you so much, guys, and uh, you're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Thank you.